नासिर गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स द सम ऑफ एनी टू साइड ऑफ अ ट्राइंगल इज ग्रेटर देन द थर्ड साइड यू कैन सी इट हियर सपोज यू आर हैविंग साइड एज फाइव सिक्स एंड सेवन इफ यू डू फाइव प्लस सिक्स इट इज ग्रेटर देन द सेवन सिक्स प्लस सेवन इज ग्रेटर देन फाइव एंड सेवन प्लस फाइव इट इज ग्रेटर देन सिक्स इफ दीज प्रॉपर्टीज आर कंटेन then it is said that it is a triangle okay the means the sum of two sides of a triangle is always equal to the greater than the third side of a triangle now let us solve self practice 10c okay let us solve self practice 10c now see question number 1 determine whether a triangles can have sides with the given length whether the triangle can have sides given with the length the c a part in a it is given 4 6 and 8 now check 4 plus 6 it is greater than 8 6 plus 8 it is greater than 4 and 8 plus 4 it is greater than 6 it is a triangle This is first A part. First B part. Five, seven point five and fourteen. Five plus seven point five. It is not. It is not. And seven point five plus fourteen greater than five. And Fourteen plus five is greater than seven point five. But here at one position it is not getting, so it is not a triangle. It is not a triangle. Okay? It should be clear with all the three points. Now see the C part. Seven point two, eight, and ten. Now see. Seven point two plus eight is greater than ten. Seven point two plus ten it is greater than eight. See, eight plus ten it is greater than seven point two. So it is a triangle. Okay, it is a triangle. You have to see whether at every places it is following or not. So it is a triangle. Now see the D part. Now see the D part. Nine, fourteen, twenty-three. Nine plus twenty. Is it greater than twenty-three? Ah, huh? is equal to. Na, that is not. And fourteen plus twenty-three, it is greater than nine. And twenty-three plus nine, it is greater than fourteen. So it is not a triangle because at one place it is not following. It is not a triangle because at first point only it is not following. Now see the F part. Eleven point nine, five point eight, and five point eight. So five point eight plus five point eight is it greater than eleven point nine? It is eleven point six. Five point eight plus eleven point nine, and five point eight. Plus eleven point nine. Is it greater than five point eight? So it is a triangle. Okay, this one is a triangle. Now see the G part. Now see the G part. Three x plus three x two x plus one. And x square. Put x is equal to five. Three into five. Two into five plus one. 
10, 5 is 12, 15, 11, 25. So 15 plus 11 is greater than 25. Yes, 11 plus 25, it is greater than 15. And 25 plus 15, is it greater than 11? It is a triangle. Okay, all the three conditions is seen here. So it is a triangle. Now, A is any point within the triangle PQR. It is given A is any point within a triangle PQR where 5, 7 and 10 cm respectively. AP, AQ, AR is greater than 11 cm. AP, AQ and AR is greater than 11 cm. So how can you say? Okay. So you should take at least 3 triangles. So take in triangle APQ in triangle APQ AP plus so AP is greater than AQ and AQ AP is greater than A, AQ and PQ. Okay? AQ and PQ. Both are greater? Yes. So AP is greater than how much is there given? AQ Ah, now see the last question of this exercise. Then you see, you see AP plus AQ means two sides is equal to the sum of the, it should be greater than the third side. So it's greater than 10. AQ plus AR greater than 5. AR plus AP greater than 7. If you will add all these three, so you will get AP plus AQ, AQ, AR, AR, AP, that is 10 plus 5 plus 7. So here you will get two times AP, AQ, AR that is greater than 22. So at last what you will get? AP plus AQ plus AR will be greater than 11. Okay. Thank you students. That's all for today and have a good day. Thank you.